You're already looking at it, but today we're cooking up A5 Wagyu. I got a really good deal from my local butcher, so let's make Wagyu Nigiri. Now I'm gonna go ahead and flip the steak over and just trim a little bit of the excess fat with my chef's knife. This Wagyu fat is gold. Save it, render it all. And I'm gonna cut this piece off. of Wagyu in half. You can see this has some incredible marbling in the middle. As you also saw, this piece of steak cut like butter. Now I can't hold it for much longer because the fat is literally starting to melt on my hands. Okay, so I'm gonna set the other half aside and I have a YouTube shorts video on Japanese Wagyu. Now to start, I'm gonna go ahead and cut diagonal cuts through the Wagyu. This will leave us with some really nice pieces for sushi. I'm gonna go ahead and keep making diagonal cuts for the sushi. So here we have sushi rice. I have a video on it, link in the description. Now that we cut enough pieces of Wagyu, we're gonna go ahead and form our sushi. To form the sushi, I'm gonna go ahead and dip my hands in cold water, a little bit of sushi rice, and start forming it together. To form it, simply just squeeze the rice together and press it down with your thumb. And there you go. They're not perfect, but they'll do. Now we're gonna gently lay down our Wagyu on our rice. Now optionally, you can add wasabi underneath, but I can't handle spice, so I'm not gonna add it. Now that we've placed the Wagyu down, we can go ahead and torch the beef. Add a little bit of flaky salt. I'm gonna go ahead and dip mine in soy sauce. Whoa, this was incredible. The Wagyu just melted in my mouth like butter. It had an amazing fatty flavor and it was extremely delicious. If you made it this far into the video, please consider subscribing, giving this video a thumbs up, and thank you for watching this video.